All right, so when it comes to laptops, it's been a while since we've seen something from Samsung. And this is their brand new Galaxy Book line. They've got a Galaxy Book Pro, which is a 13 and 15 inch, and they've got a Galaxy Book Pro 360, which is their convertible version, and also 13, 15 inches. So very simple, two simple SKUs, and that's it. Now, when it comes to specs, they're very similar for both devices. You've got the Intel 11 Gen with XE graphics, which is great to see, so we should expect good battery life uh, and also good performance from both of them. I don't have exact numbers for battery life, but I'll let you know once we get any of these devices in-house to test. Also, uh, both devices come with either eight gigabytes of RAM up to 16. There's also LTE variants as well, as you would expect from devices like this. And of course, storage options go up to one terabyte. So those are the basics you'll find here. Now with the Galaxy Book Pro 360, the convertible, this device felt really nice and comfortable. It's a 13 inch laptop, nice and compact, very nice when you put it on your lap to type or if you're flipping around watching content with either mode you use, it feels really good. Now, of course, that display you're looking at is a super AMOLED display. So think about the great displays you see on your Galaxy smartphones. You have it right here. It is a 1080p display, by the way, but it still looks really good, which hopefully will save you on battery life, right, by the way. now. This is also a touch display and you can use your S Pen. Not the one that comes in your Galaxy Note, but one that is built for this device. S Pen gives you some of those S Pen features that you like. None of the Bluetooth features for this S Pen, but you can go ahead and of course take uh, screenshots, take notes down, you know, talk about Conor Sangala, write his name down, or Chef Daniel. Whatever you want to do, you can definitely you do with that S Pen, uh, which is really nice. In terms of ports, on the 13-inch uh, 360, we do have two USB Type-C ports. One is a Thunderbolt port. Uh, we also do have a headphone jack and an SD card slot for this device. And I have to say, it's a light and comfortable device to use all the way. Now, when we move to the 15-inch Galaxy Book Pro, not the 360, just the 15-inch Galaxy Book Pro, this device really surprises you when you pick it up. It is super, super light. You can't imagine how I felt just picking it up from the desk and I just wanted to toss it up because it felt like, like featherweight. Now this is because both devices are built with series six aluminum or aluminum, whichever way you want to pronounce it, making it military grade and very light and also something that's quite durable. And I have to see how it tests out, but so far, I like the comfortable fit with it. So when I'm sitting outside, I'm typing, I'm walking around with this device, I feel really comfortable carrying it just the short period of time I had because of the weight. Now, the device comes with an AMOLED display. It doesn't have a touch screen. Again, it's also 1080p. And this device does come with a few more ports besides, of course, the USB Type-C, the Thunderbolt port. It also has a full HDMI port as well. Uh, and you do have a headphone jack. So you've got some connectivity there, as well as a micro SD card slot, you know, if you uh, definitely need that. Now, the keyboards for both of them are feel really nice and comfortable. So you get that from typing on either of these devices. And in terms of battery life, I don't know what the battery wattage is, but we'll see when that comes through. Samsung did say it does come with a 65 watt charger for both devices. So expect to have that with your device to give you fast charging. It is of course a USB type C charger and that is actually pretty nice to see. Now, besides all those features, both of them will also include Samsung software, giving you features like, you know, link to text. So you can actually text uh, from your your laptop to your smartphone. You can also do things like transfer of files and photos over. So all those features will also be added to this device, which is actually pretty cool. I think overall though, Samsung has something that looks nice and unique. We'll have to see what pricing looks like for both of them. And also we have to see what it does in terms of performance, but I do like the weight. I do like the feel, and I think you guys will like it too. So definitely check out more on the Galaxy Book Pro and the Galaxy Book Pro 360. If you wanna check out more laptops on the, on the channel, we do have a few laptop reviews. So go ahead and check them out and I'll catch you in the next video.